would have loved to watch race. He'll bring him down. Ladies and gentlemen, the green is out and we are racing. Everyone hold a breath. Trouble, trouble, trouble. I believe that is CJ Leary. Yeah, hard contact there with the nose of the 30 machine into the concrete. He can stretch his leg at this racetrack and maybe get it done. He comes out aggressively, does Dave Garland. But so does Justin Grand. Whoa! Slide across the bow. Everyone clutch them, their midsection and hope it will work out. Justin doesn't care. He fights right back. Garland's saying, well, guess what? I'm ready to do this. Wyndham, rather. Wyndham's the man who's made that move. I apologize. Long ways here in the dark. Wyndham has shot out quickly. Say It looks like a repeat from here earlier in the season here back in July during the USAC Amsoil Indiana Sprint Week race with Darlin instead being the meat in the sandwich instead of stocking in between the two NOS energy drink cars. The bear right now out showing the way. Yeah, it sure is. And I apologize to this the driver there because it's just a long ways away. Oh, good strong move by Chris as he goes down to the bottom. Yeah, Darlin's starting to encounter the same problem that Wyndham had when he got up there. They're side by side battling for position. Those guys aren't gonna give an inch either because as you said, every position matters here for points here at the end of the year. And right now, the Bear right now tiptoeing through traffic with the veteran and Dave Darlin trying to stalk him and track him down. And don't look now, but Justin Grant is starting to close in on the back of the 36D of Darlin. Well, Justin Grant is probably out of it for the title chase given how much trouble he's had, but you never know. He's right there in a strong position, but needs wins and needs others to have misfortune. Notice the madman Robert Ballou up in that battle as well. He slipped by Brady Bacon. He's up to fourth, and he's looking for more here in lap traffic. They are really slicing and dicing here at the action track tonight. 1.2, the advantage of Wyndham over Darlin. Grant and Robert Ballou. The time is running out. The white flag is out. Keep an eye on that battle into one to see if Grant goes for the dive bomb. Indeed he does. He's going to go for the second spot. Can he slide up in front of Double D? No, he cannot. Pat, bring us home. Well, Chris Wyndham is one of the best in the business, as we've known for a number of years now. He heads down to try to win for the fourth time in the Herder Beast Classic and the 28th time in his USAC career. Double checkered flags for Big Daddy Chris Wyndham. Dave Darlin. There's Justin Grant, Robert Ballou.